Hello folks, we are doing a, a, a set of very short videos before the, the, the D-Day, the last one week run up to that, trying to answer a bunch of questions, very short, hopefully fun. How to revise topics in quant effectively? And so several times I've been asked this question, so I'm going to think about how I would do it. So if I were hitting geometry, I would say, okay, straight line properties, intersecting lines, parallel lines, then I go to triangle, simple triangle properties, sides and angles. Then I go to angle bisector theorem, basic proportionality theorem, write that down. Then congruent triangles, similar triangles. And I tell myself, whenever the diagrams are like this, I should think about similar triangles. Whenever rectangles are involved, I should think about similar triangles. Then I move to circles, basic properties. Then I go on to tangents and circles. Then move to quadrilaterals, then polygons. So I should have three sheets or a mental map that goes through all of this. After this, I sit down and say, okay, kind of things I usually miss out, angle bisector theorem, tangent secant theorem, alternate segment theorem. I, every time questions come on these, I see in the solution that it is easy, but in the exam, I've not done it. I need to remember these three words. They need to be triggers for me. Idea that I consistently overlook, similar triangles. Concept that I need refreshing, equilateral triangle, right angle triangle, two shapes, circle inside square, square inside circle, circle inside equilateral triangle, equilateral triangle inside square, those type of ideas to make things fresh. Nice. This is what I'm going to do in the next half an hour. Grab it and then go to the next topic. If I'm doing speed time distance, I'm going to say units, uh, two objects moving, thinking in terms of ratios, uh, relative distance, train crossing platform, boat and stream, multiple things changing, linear races, circular races. Done. This is a scheme of things. What do I generally forget? I, I generally, when it comes to relative distance, I completely forget relative distance by relative time or relative speed, not relative time. And then I write those two equation. I need to remember that I can think about relative distance, relative speed. Uh, what I need to be careful about? Units are done. So these are the things I need to worry about. What is the topic that I'm not comfortable at all in this? Circular races. I still don't get where that HCF thing comes, where maybe there's an LCM thing. I don't understand that. It has not fallen in place. I'll revisit that and then go to the go to the next thing. So you've got to list out everything that is there. Think about the thing that needs to be super fresh. Think about where your blind spots are. Think about what you need to reinforce. Go to the next one. That's all.